Now, these are one of the reasons why you do the daily math sheet. Your maths has to be razor sharp for these. And you've got about 30 seconds per question. So there's no time for messing around. But at the moment, and for some months to come, concentrate on just getting them right. Speed will come. So let's have a look at this one. Can you see how difficult these are to see? Um, sometimes it's just combinations of colours. Those are nice and clear, aren't they? So 3 to 6 is plus 3. 6 to 9 is plus 3. 9 to 12 is plus 3. Always work your way along. Don't just go plus 3. Must be all plus 3. Because that's the path to the dark side, my child. So it will be 12 plus 3 makes 15. Ta rum And that's right. Next one. Uh, let's give ourselves... Should we go for pure red? This could be a bit difficult. Ooh, now if we go, that's plus one, plus two, plus two, plus three. Hmm, not good. There's nothing times in going on, is there? Um, that doesn't help. So think of other things. And this is what's happening. That plus that equals that. That plus that equals that. That plus that equals that. So that plus that equals 13. It's called the Fibonacci sequence. Good, isn't it? Almost certain to turn up. Almost certain to turn up. I just want to give you a quick um, sort of heads up on this sort of thing. If the numbers are getting gradually bigger, then it's generally plussing. You just look at the numbers and get a feel for what's happening. If they're getting gradually smaller, it's generally taking away. If they're getting um, mostly bigger, but occasionally going down, it, um, chances are it's mostly plus with a bit of taking away. On the other hand, it could just as easily be mostly going down, but a bit of up. And therefore, it's mostly take away but with a bit of either every now and again. Sometimes the numbers come out and they are going up gently and then woo, they go right up. This is a times. Um, so they get a little bit bigger, a little bit, and then they go way bigger. It's a times. If they're coming, uh, they're getting gradually smaller and then a lot smaller, that's a divide. And so it's a crocodile. eating things. That is a crocodile vomiting. Blah. Just keep an eye on the patterns as to what's happening. It can make a big difference. Next one. Let's have a look what's going on here. Uh, plus one, plus two, plus two, plus four. Hmm. Um, nothing obvious happening there. There's no timesing, is there? There's nothing adding. So there's something else we need to look for. Oh, oh, this is a nasty one. They're prime numbers. A prime number is a number that's only divisible by itself and one. So two can only be divided by two or one. Three can only be divided by uh, three or one. Five can only be divided by five or one. 7 can only be divided by 7 or 1. 11 can only be divided by 11 or 1. So the next one is 13. <sighs> Nasty that. Once, once you get your eye in for those, they're a bit easier. But do you know, I did one of those sort of daft Mensa tests. It was in a newspaper when I was bored and I couldn't do it. And it was that, it was that that got me. I felt such an honour. I really did. Now let's have a look at this one. We're going to use some bright green. I do like a bit of bright green. So that's plus, oh, except you can't see it. No, it didn't help either, did it? Uh, let's go for that blue. Swizzle it round. Man, that pink shows up nicely, doesn't it? So we'll write with the pink. Plus 19. Plus 19. Plus 19. Still don't like it. Plus, now don't try and do that in your head. Trying to do it in your head will just lead to trouble. So use written workings. 77, take away 39, 2, ooh, 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 4, 
42. Hello, right here. There's something going wrong there. I'm not convinced. What have I done wrong? 77. Take away 39. I'm an idiot. I did 9 take away 7, didn't I? 7 take away 9. Did you shout? You didn't shout, did you? You just looked confused. What? Why? Shout at the screen. Come on. This is an interactive game. It's plus 38, isn't it? Next one. Well, just have a feel for when it's going wrong. After a while, you just sort of, your inner sense, which is better at maths than you are, will just shout out and go, it's wrong. Three take away seven, you can't do. Four, 13 take away seven is six. 14 to 76 is 76. Now, this is where, again, your instincts need to come in. That times two makes that, that times 2 makes that. So that times 2 is the next integer. Should we give ourselves some space now? So, um, 76 plus 76, 12, carry the 1, 152. So that's not the answer, that's the next bit that you have to add on. So it's that, add that, makes that. That, add that, makes that. That, add that, makes that. So this and that makes um, one five. Why wasn't that? I just didn't write it down, did I? Plus one five three uh, five. Carry the one. So it's the answer is three hundred and five. But there is another way. You could say times two take away one. Times two take away one. So that would be forty take away one times 2 would be 78 take away 1 77 times 2 would be 154 take away 1 is 153 so 153 times 2 is 306 take away 1 is that there's quite often that there are different ways of, of a I think the real mathematicians can see that it's the same thing but it looks different, feels different. Next one, 2, 4, 8, 16. Now, can you see the numbers are getting a little bit bigger, a little, and then they go, woo, bigger. So this is a times, times 2, times 2, times 2. So it's 16 times 2 is 32. Now the next one, 30. Ah, oh, now this is one that's getting a lot smaller. It goes, ooh, and therefore it's a divide. Divide by 2, divide by 2, divide by 2, and then 7 point, um, ooh. Try again. Wrong purple. Never mind. Um, 7.5 divided by 2. 2 goes into that 3 times, 2 goes into 5 twice, give ourselves a naught, um, remainder 1, 2 goes into 10 5 times. So the answer we want is 3.25. And I've only got one left to go that. This has gone quite fast, hasn't it? Um, ooh, and now we've got one like this. Looks a bit scary. It's not getting bigger it's not getting smaller but it seems to be doing that so I think we've got some ads and takeaways let's try that and see minus one plus two minus one so we have to assume that's plus two two plus two makes four it's quite easy once you got into it wasn't it just get good at mental arithmetic and play with the numbers. There aren't too many tricks they can put in, but you do have to be razor sharp on the maths and so used to it that you can just see when you make a silly mistake. Silly mistakes guaranteed to happen. So you just have to have enough experience that your inner alarm bell says when to stop and something's happened. See you soon.